Hey everyone, this is Rick. I just wanted to share an experience that I'd cleaned recently. A couple of uh, basketball, like sports magazines, something I was unfamiliar with. So someone approached me and said, hey, can you do this for me? I'll uh, pay you. I said, yeah, we'll do it for free. I don't want you to pay me. So I did it for him and got a couple of meds boxing and needed cleaning. I'll show you some photos in a minute. But all I did was wipe it down with a Mackie clean, this stuff here, and, and then I wiped it with water. I pressed it with two of these chamfered pressing boards and a silicone sheet in between two of these metal aluminum boards. And then I put it under a cold press for two days to make sure the none of those uh, wavies came back. That's it. That is really, oh no, I did a Maculite on, um, on the first one, the basketball one, uh, around the edges. I put a mask in the middle because there's a lot of red. so. Uh, put some 6% peroxide and it did 45 minutes of immaculate on that the 435 nanometer and that is all I did folks uh, Here's here's the before and after pictures. I hope you enjoy the video I'm trying to keep it brief. So it's more fun uh, Take care. See you. Bye. Bye This first picture is a little washed out, but the left is initial right is the final picture Here's the upper right hand corner You can see it's cleaner. It needs more work of course, but for initial quick pass. It's good. Here's the spine there was some foxing here. Looks like it's mostly gone now. The uh, the bottom right corner, you can see some of that reddish material. Uh, there was a fingerprint here along this right edge. I just wiped it off with the Immacu Clean. And the bottom center, was, I think it, probably the biggest difference is right here. You can see that, that looks a lot better. The Maculite took care of that stuff. And then this was a different magazine. It's wrinkly in the top center. Just wiped it down, pressed it. No light on this one. Looks better, of course, you know. And then just one more picture of this one because there's not much more. The story is just the spine, the left spine here. You can see that there. It's, you know, it's a better looking book if you're into uh, whoever this guy is, a uh, basketball person, uh, magazines. Anyway, folks, there, there you go. There wasn't much to it. It was a simple job, but it was a fun new kind of thing for me anyway, because it's not a Hulk 181 or a Spider-Man 129, you know, it's a, something I don't normally do. So it was interesting and fun. I hope you, hope you enjoyed the video. Take care. See you later.